I Simran Kaushal welcome everyone on the brand new episode of Science Bits only on Bharata First. This season is all about science which is simplified in a short, crisp and a unique manner by the experts. This platform provides a unique opportunity to explore your scientific temper and skills. Science Bits involves explanation of the topics ranging from the recent trends and developments in the field of science and technology to the discussion of the previous year questions and potential concepts which are important from the perspective of competitive exams let your curiosity out and ask questions through a form whose link has been provided in the description box below do make use of this opportunity now i would like to introduce to a science expert dr tv venkateshwaran who is here with us to answer the questions Dr. D. V. Venkateshwaran is a senior scientist at Vigyan Prasad, New Delhi. He is also founder of India Science Wire. So, the first question for today is: What are tar balls recently seen on the beaches of Mumbai, and how they? What are related concerns? To them? So, uh, there were news uh, recently that uh, near Mumbai, for example, tar balls. I mean, like. Uh, Uh, small uh, marble sized or uh, tennis ball sized uh, black tar was uh, seen on the beaches uh, not just in mumbai in many parts of the countries uh, this has been uh, reported mumbai became news because uh, it's a big city and then uh, it's on the media glare okay so it's been reported in many places and it has been reported from uh, many parts of the world so if you look here i mean uh, you can see that uh, the uh, sea waves are carrying the uh, tar balls and the tar balls uh, when they reach uh, the uh, sea shore uh, they uh, sometimes get uh, lodged on to the uh, beach sand and then they are seen in the sea coast in uh, many parts of the world okay so this is the tar ball uh, what is it uh, there are possibly two sources of uh, tar balls okay one is that uh, under the earth we know that uh, uh, there are uh, petroleum uh, uh, cache okay so maybe for example there is a, a crude oil cache somewhere under the ocean maybe there is a small crack through which uh, the uh, natural oil is seepaging into the uh, ocean so if it is seepaging into the ocean then this will come to the surface and be there as a oil slick okay the second is possibly uh, ships which carry uh, oil can possibly spill oil okay so then that can also cause oil slick and when you have a oil slick because of uh, sunlight there will be something called as photo oxidization and then there will be also evaporation and then uh, along with uh, water there will be also some kind of a biodegradation all these things put together creates tar ball which then uh, start spreading in the ocean and then move towards the uh, uh, shore because of the waves and then they uh, come and uh, deposit themselves in the shore that's uh, uh, what people think is happening with regard to tar ball so it could be mainly oil spill or sometimes for example uh, natural oil seepage from uh, uh, under the sea uh, remember that uh, near bombay there is bombay hike which essentially mean that uh, there is a huge amount of uh, natural uh, crude oil below the uh, surface of the sea in that area 